Peace, one love to each and every single one of you guys and girls out there. Yes, yes, we have a fantastic afternoon strain review. Yes, yes, we've had to leave this one to the afternoon because it is rather strong. So this is the French macaroon, people. This is the one you've been waiting for, the French macaroon. Lovely, lovely, lovely nag. We've saved this especially. Welcome, welcome to Justin's World, people. Cheers. So this is where we review this very, very nice strain. We tell you what it's like in our layman's terms, yeah? And, you know, just have a smoke along with us and chill out. So that's what it's all about, yeah? It's about getting that medication in and obviously sharing is caring. You know what I mean? With like-minded people, yeah? So any information on this beautiful flower, by all means, just stick it in the comments. But as you can see, she's a dirty bitch. She is filthy. Oh, look at her. <gasps> she is fucking gorgeous, isn't she? Isn't she gorgeous? Just look. Just have a look. Just going to pass it to Ninja before we crack a lap it. Oh, mate, I've been looking forward to this. Now, we did have a little bit of it, um, and what I can tell you, it is an absolute fucking powerhouse. Um, we obviously saved the biggest bud <laughs> for the review, but we tried some, didn't we? And we were like, wow, that is just like really, 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 you know what I mean? Yeah. But yeah, for all intents and purposes, that is exactly how I want to see it, peeps. It's a French macaroon. Yes. Right then, let's get into it. So, obviously, it's quite, quite a nice structure to it. Again, it's a nice, solid nug, which is exactly how you want it. Um, it smells very weedy-like, if you, do you know what I mean? Just a generic weedy type sort of cannabis smell to it. I wouldn't say it's got anything particularly of notice at the moment, but obviously it's a closed, closed nugget at the minute. We'll open them up and we'll see what it smells like. But yeah, it's got like a, just, just like a kind of a bit of a skunky smell to it, if I've got, if I'm being honest. And I can't really smell anything more, but some buds are like that until you crack them open. So we'll just crack it open, eh? So let's have a look. Let's just turn the music down for a minute. As you can see, it's got a nice solid stem all the way through it. But we'll just go straight for the middle. We're going to be fucking brutal, yeah? Ready? Sick. Yeah. Okay. So, as you could hear, perfect snap straight down the middle. Which means it's perfectly cured. It's just perfectly cured. Now, straight away, I'm getting a little bit of a cocoa type smell from that. Don't say that because I just said that. Do you smell and tell me what you, you smell from that, Ninja? Yeah, but look. Look at the upskirt. Look at the upskirt. Very musky, yeah? So good. She's getting musky. Right, then. Let's get it in the grinder and then we'll know what we're talking about, won't we? Why so. At it. Yeah. Can you see any bits of purple? Yeah, it's it is. It. It's very, very orangey. It's dark greens, light greens. You get like purple sort of hues, sort of like leaves, basically. You know, like the backs of the leaves and that. So yeah. Yeah. Per quite a purpley strain. So, what are you saying? Well, the French macaroon. Yeah. Is gelato thirty three. Yeah. Crossed with French cookies. French cookies. Yes. Okay. Now, okay. when I tried it yesterday, yeah, I could taste something very distinctive, and I couldn't figure out what it was. Okay. And I think it was obviously the cookie taste. The cookie, the French cookie taste. That I, feel. I think yeah. it was very really distinctive, and I just like I couldn't work out what it was. Yeah, there you go. But it, it had a really nice creamy, like um. A short, ready kind of taste. You liked it, didn't you? Yeah, I really did like she it. She really got the flavour. Well, I think that should have gone through. But it says that the bud um, can be really hard to see the beautiful dark purple buds underneath. 
Oh, you, when, you, when, you, yeah, when you split it, but like that, look, because you can see the colours yeah. there. So you can really see the colours. That's what Ninja was on about. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but there are purples in it. There are purples in it. Right, so... First impression of that is gas, a lot of gas, a lot of gas. So I am kind of getting that cookie dough sort of gassy type of like, yeah, skunky, I don't know what the fuck it is, but it stinks like a motherfucker. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it is. Well, it definitely has a gas Oosh. smell to it. Fucking loads of gas. Loads and loads and loads of gas. Thanks, Scrappy, that's your seat. Right then, let's get it into a, uh, a bowl and let's see what it fucking smokes like. I mean, obviously we've had a small, a little bud, haven't we? This is a big, fat, nice, yeah. juicy nug. So I'm expecting plenty more flavour out of this. It's mostly indica, but I can't see a... what split it is. No, definitely on the indica side. Yeah. I'm definitely getting a cookie... Um, biscuity type sort of skunky, you know, that type yeah. of fucking smell from this. Sorry, let me pass it. Right. Ninja. Yeah, don't drop it. Don't drop the grinder, right? Seriously. If you watched the last review, <laughs> like you you couldn't literally, I couldn't have filmed that and made it any better than what I did, because it's just like, do you know what I mean? Ninja dropped the grinder. I was, I was forgiven. Have you enjoyed all that? Yes. Yeah. Right then, let's have it. Smoke up, roll up, choke up with me. This is the French macaroon from the A to the B. Cheers, people. Very gassy. Very gassy. <coughs> <coughs> yeah. I'm getting that. I'm getting that quirkiness of like the French macaroon flavour coming through. It is a biscuity type, cookie dough type, I don't fucking know what, but it's fucking just gassy and cookie, it's and doughy, big. and biscuity, and all that good shit, all that, all that. Again, just like to point out, we've got pretty, pretty nice, nice colour ash here. Do you know what I mean? Not bad. I've seen whiter, but that's pretty, pretty good to be fair. Yeah, man. <coughs> right, well, first, first of all, Gotta say, it's, a, and it's another one of them lung expanders again. So you have it, you fucking know you've had it. You know, you can hear my voice kind of wincing in the background. So, yeah, full, full, full capacity in the lungs. Really, really nice, really, really satisfying as well. You know, when you have a good sort of like solid bong like this, something decent like this, it just like, do you know what I mean? It just really fucking satisfies you, doesn't it? It fills your lungs completely, and you just get that boom! And that's what I get with this tray, and you get an incredible um, sort of high to it very, very quickly. <coughs> nice. So we have to, we'll learn, yeah? You got it? Got it? But pass me that grinder before you fuck. Do you want to know, actually, before you do, load yourself another one, <coughs> but don't drop the grinder. Ninja. That's you coughing in the chime, sir. <coughs> <coughs> Here's a good one. Very unusual, although it has got that, like I say, that cookie dough, that sort of biscuity sort of texture to it. When it's going down, there is something else on top. There is that macaroon coming through, so I can see why they've named it French macaroon. Because there is, like I say, there's a, there's a there's a quirkiness to it at the end. There's a, there's, there's another 
There's another flavour on top of it, isn't there? So yeah. you're getting the gas, then you are getting this this other like what would you even describe as you like shortbread or something, didn't you? It is, it's like um <coughs> like French macaroon. Yeah, it's like it'll yeah, be like a, French a creamy, desserty yeah. type biscuit. But I'm getting that biscuity type, yeah. do you know what I mean? I'm really getting that. It's so distinctive, it is just so distinctive. I'm gonna obviously have another one. We're on the volcano right for a while as well. Lord, we need to get some bags still. We still haven't got any bags, people. Yeah. Again, volcano, if you're watching, you know, we're promoting your machine for free. Send us some freaking bags, yeah? <laughs> <coughs> Cheers. Again, really, really nice for you guys who smoke joints. I could see that going into a joint and just being very, 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 very nice, satisfying, fucking heavy indica joint, you know what I mean? Which would stink like fuck. So, it has got a smell to it. It has uh, all these strains with gas in them. I find they are a little bit more offensive in the air. So you do need to be a little bit more careful. <laughs> Obviously, where you're smoking them because <coughs> my god, you're smelling a mile off, aren't you? To be fair, this isn't a um, I'm gonna have a secret one under the stairs and nobody's gonna know about it because fucking the whole house is gonna know about this one. Let me tell you, it stinks to high heaven, but it's a for, for me, it's a nice smell for you out there who like, like these sort of you know, you're gonna love it as well. Do you know what I mean? You're gonna love anything sort of gassy like this, but obviously, what I am saying is you have to be uh, cautious towards other people around you when you're smoking these strains and if you are like in a little flat where I was like before and I've got people above me and people below me <laughs> when I was smoking these sort of strains I was just, you know what I mean? It was like all the fucking windows open if I was smoking in the flat at that point it'd be a case of, you know, you can't just have a, a sneaky one and walk around and just have one window open you've got to fucking air the place do you know what I mean? to have one of them because it fucking lingers, do you know what I mean? it lingers but fucking yeah. lovely and these are the best these are the best cannabises, to be honest with you. They're the fucking stinky ones. Let's be honest. Fucking lovely. This is probably one of my favourites as an indica. It feels fucking lush. It's not rushing, I'm not rushing. I need some tissue. You keep talking. Talk about the flavour! <laughs> camera. Right, sit there, behave. Behave, because this is my side. <laughs> I feel it in, uh, it's definitely on, there is some sativa in it, because I've got a little bit in the head. Yeah. I've got a little bit in the head, definitely. <coughs> um, but this isn't, this isn't a wake and bake straight. This isn't something that you want to get up and you want to start smoking in the morning. <laughs> well, you might do if you had the day off or something, but I would probably say that, do you know what I mean? You'll probably be asleep by three o'clock if you started waking and baking on this. You'd be going for a little afternoon, little kippy, do you know what I mean? Which could be a good thing. If you wanted a nice relaxing day and you just needed to unwind and you just needed to chill and you needed to recharge your batteries, that would be very, very good for you, definitely. But other than that, um, it would be a case of just on the evening. So again, when you're trying to relax, you've come home from work, you've done this, that, the other, you just need something just to take the edge off it and just put you in a better place. That's gonna do it to be, to be fair every single time. Do you know what I mean? Perfect nighttime one because again, after a few hours, I think you're gonna feel sleepy with it. Depending on how much of it you smoke, to be fair. Because the first one I have had, I feel quite chatty on, I feel quite energetic. <laughs> Which is why I say I can feel I feel there is sativa in it. There is obviously, you know what I mean? But yeah, my bum's planted as well. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> I don't want to move. But cheers people, let's have another one. Um 
Wow, that's quite strong effects for one. Yeah, I've just found a little bit more information. It says the high comes on fast and generates feelings of relaxation, happiness and euphoria. Yeah, get that. Yeah. These feelings eventually trail off into sleepiness and immense hunger. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so you're basically, you're probably going to fall asleep, wake up two or, two or three hours later, go to the cupboards, raid the fucking cupboards of everything, <laughs> go back to bed and you've got no crisps left, basically. Scrap it, get out. <laughs> it says that this mind-blowing flavour will ignite a serious case of the munches, yeah. especially for something oh, filling and Feeling sweet. hungry, actually, as you're saying that. <laughs> Cheers, people. Smoke up, roll up, choke up with me. Yes, yes. Macaroon is ice and sugar sandwiched together between two <coughs> pieces of almond flavour meringue. So they've tried to get that into the. That almond thing's probably what you're getting through at the end. It's a weird leveling. Mm. The name fits the. the the bud, it really does. I got you fucking speak tank, look, you know. It just says really it's strong. I feel like he's pulling my face down like that. Ah. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? He's pulling my face down. Fucking white ash again. Lovely, that's what I want to want to see to be fair. Really lovely strain this. Absolute fucking treat. We've had some bounces just recently. <coughs> so by all means, if you're new to the channel. Um, go back and have a look. We've got nearly 500 reviews now. Uh, but yeah, we've had some bounces just recently. I went a little bit like that for a little while, didn't it? Through lockdown, and it's just yeah. starting to come through now a little bit. <coughs> things, things are starting to pick up. Like I say, <coughs> through lockdown, it was dog, dog, lemon, dog, basically. What we were getting, wasn't it? But do you know what I mean? This is fucking. And then when you get these strains, like, which you've not, like, say, you're not that, not not experienced it, but you haven't had them for a little while. It's like, whoa, I forgot what yeah. that feels like, mate. But do you know what I mean? But then I remember it as well. Yeah, if that makes any sense, which I normally generally don't. Hey, man, I feel fucking lovely. <coughs> this is definitely not a. You wouldn't want to be, um, put it this way, you wouldn't want to be operating any machinery with this strain, yeah? That's one thing I will say. Certain strains you can just carry on your normal day with. You know, a lot of the sativas, you just, they almost make you fucking better, don't they? They make yeah, you superhuman, yeah. do you know what I mean? To be fair, so you could literally just crack on and do stuff as normal, um, do you know what I mean? Mow the lawn, do whatever, you know, even, even whatever. You know, whatever you needed to do, you could do. Yeah, there's probably no <coughs> limits. But with this one, I've got to say, you wouldn't want to be sort of driving or anything like that with this this particular strain. This because, is a come home from yeah, work, school, definitely. School, but college. If you were going to class it, you know, if you were going to put it in a alcohol scale, this is a whiskey. This is a whiskey. This is a brandy. Yeah. This is a vodka. This is a strong one at the end of the night, yeah, it's it's a lot, lot, lot different. Like, um, fucking hell, Ninja, I can't even remember Ninja's name. <laughs> Jesus Christ, because I've got so many names <coughs> yeah. I can't it's, even... a, it's definitely uh, an unwind kind of It is, it is. It's and like it's... home, kick your shoes off. Yeah, but again, if you were in pain, and say you hurt yourself somewhere, you hurt your back, you know what I mean? You were suffering from some sort of 
physical pain, yeah. this would really, really, you know, reduce that pain for you. It's got pain relieving properties. It feels almost like narcotic, to be fair, like taking a, a tablet or something, because it is quite fucking heavy. So, um, yeah, not for the faint art yet. I'd say, yeah, if, uh, if you would, if you didn't really smoke a lot, you would just need a small amount of this. Just maybe one. Like I said, <laughs> having that second one now, I feel like, wow, that's really, really affects me. That's really strong, that is. Really strong. Isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Well, we're going to have to put it in a little. Have I got enough for a cartridge? I have. Lovely, right? Just fill that capsule up a little bit, people. It could be a little bit fuller, but if uh, it'll, it'll do for this little test, so it's got a nice amount in it. I know we like to put a pinch more and just get a bit more in them, but they say not to do that with it anyway. <coughs> so the best thing to do is just sort of like, you know what I mean? Just stick it in, but don't jam it in, like, you know what I mean? Jam it in. Jam it. Jam, jam it. Hope you like jamming too. We're jamming, jamming, jamming. Oh, I hope you like jamming too. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful. Should we go for a second sandwich? Should we go for a second sandwich, people? Ready? Let's see how good this is. Oh, yeah, there That's you get it. Yeah, mate, that is beautiful, lovely. Let's get that in there. Nice, nice. Uh, Scrappy, what are you doing, man? <laughs> Dude, <coughs> you keep, you keep nicking my seat. Scrappy, stop it. Um, I'm going to need to sit down there in a second, yeah, because I'm doing a review. <laughs> Grab I don't know if the camera's picking that up, but my cat, it just literally, as soon as you get up, she's just got to get in my chair. Scrappy, you got that chair. Go on the YouTube side, yeah? You'll be famous there, look. People have pushed the button. That's it, sit there. That's it, good girl. Push Scrappy. Push Scrappy. No, you're not coming over. What are you doing? <laughs> <coughs> She's like, ah, shut up with your face. Right then. Cheers, people. Oh, gas. Just gas. Gas. A little bit like hairspray as well. Can't describe it. So it's hair so it's quite gassy, isn't it? Really gassy, yeah. Oh wait. It just tastes fucking powerful. Lots of gas in that. Oh my god. If I remember rightly, they sent me to see the other night. I think I was going to see that night too. Why? <coughs> These things always affect me more. The vaping fucking just like, whoa, man, seriously, you just put the fucking cream on the fucking top. Gas, 
There's a little bit of fruit coming through, but not a lot. But it's like, I don't know. <coughs> it, I got that sort of hairspray type gassiness to start with. <coughs> like, like maybe like a butane or something. That's how gassy it was. I know it's tasting a little bit cakey again. Mmm. Yeah. Strong. Really strong effects. I'm going to pass this to you now because I can't do it anymore. Sorry, I had to go off camera for a second because it is fucking just. Your eyes are red. Oh, Jesus Christ, literally. Um, it's not very often to see your eyes like that. Fucking hell. The effects on that one are, like I said, not for the faint hearted at all. Um, you're going to feel sleepy quite quickly if you are smoking lots of this. Obviously, if you had a joint of it, and you were smoking other bits and pieces between, it'd be absolutely mint to be fair. But if you were just smoking this, solely this, you would be on your ass very, very quickly. I am an experienced smoker. I've been smoking for many, 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 many years. And I've got to say, this is pretty fucking strong. This is pretty fucking strong. I've got to wipe that tear from my eye. <laughs> yeah. And that one as well. I always get that. I start wiping my eyes and I get stoned. I don't know do that. There's nothing there. You're trying to wipe the stone, trying to wipe the stoneness away, aren't you? The haze in your eyes, but it's fucking that's the weed, man. This is proper fucking Cheech and Chong, man. I don't know where the fuck I am right now. Sort of weed. This is this is heavy, heavy. Really, really nice. A real treat, actually. Really, really like it. Um, but yeah, you'd like to say, you wouldn't, you wouldn't like to say, if you just sat the odd sativa joint and then you come across some of it, you'd have to be a little bit careful, I would say, to be fair. But then again, what's the worst that would happen? You'd fucking fall asleep and then eat it, and wake up and eat the fucking cupboards. So, it's not the, uh, it's not the end of the world, is it? Flavours out of this world, you know what I mean? So again, it gets tense because the way we rate things. You know, 10 out of 10 always because of the look of it. I've got two little bits in the back, mate. But yeah, so I mean, all, all, all well and good. It snapped all the way through. It was cured perfectly. It's got a lovely, lovely, nice purpley, orangey, dark green, light green look to it. Really, really nice. Lovely, lovely, um, sort of thick, thick, pungent, you know, pungent clouds you get with it. When you have one, you feel like you have one, and that's the type of weed that I really, really like, to be fair. So all round, again, to the looks, you know, the effects of it, as you can see, it's quite transparent, you know. It, it's affected me quite, like, I can't even fucking, like, I don't even know what I'm doing. Yeah, it is, doesn't it? You can't fucking, I don't know what to say now. <laughs> it's a fucking good one. But yeah, so it looks, effects, taste, you know what I mean, all round, 10 out of 10 again, it's a definite, if you've seen it, and you know, you could get hold of it, you 100% would, you do everything you could to get hold of this strain, you'd go right, yes. So I would say to you out there, French macaroon, 10 out of 10, you get your chances, 
by all means. Do you know what I'm yeah, saying? Try it. Yeah, it's a good one. Spain's going to be opening up soon. Amsterdam's going to be opening up soon. You know, if you don't get a chance to try it in the UK, you know, if you're not lucky enough. No, I, I'm sure those those places will be doing sort of strains now. I think they'll be ready for business. So you know what I mean? I'm sure a lot of people are booking their Spain holidays now as it is. So make sure you look out for Ada people. So cheers, from Justin's world. That is definite. <coughs> <Fucking coughs> hell. Strong effects from the French macaroon. Ten out of ten. Peace, one love, people. Yes, yes. Thanks for watching. Yeah. If you're not subscribed already. Hit that button because we're nearly there. Yes, yes, and thanks to everyone for supporting the channel. Peace, one love. Cheers.